How is it going everybody? You're watching the Nabal Tech and today I'm going to show you how to remove the annoying iPhone calendar virus in iOS 15 because the process is a little bit different from iOS 14 so that's why this video. So the iPhone calendar virus as it's known is this those very annoying events that are created automatically I mean you didn't create them and they may say a ton of different messages sometimes those messages may say congratulations you won uh, or tap here uh, to earn money or something like that and sometimes th those messages may be a little bit more threatening uh, saying that your iPhone got infected it has viruses there was a malicious attack it got hacked and so so many different things and so many different annoying messages but the good news is there's only one method to get rid of everything so in this video i'm gonna show you how you get rid of them and it's super super easy so let's get started so first things first the iphone calendar virus is not an actual virus so you can relax because your iphone didn't get hacked no one can steal your data there are no viruses on your iphone nothing like that because those messages that you saw that i showed you those are just spam messages those are not real messages those are just spams just like those messages you get on your email all right so you can be cool you can relax and the only reason you're seeing those messages on your calendar is because you have subscribed to a third-party calendar uh, probably unintentionally you have subscribed to a calendar and now this calendar is sending you a ton of spam messages that's the explanation as i said you can relax no problems at all with your device now how to actually remove them and it's super super easy guys all you gotta do is open up your calendar app and that's why i created this video because in ios 14 it was different it was through the settings app and then you're gonna tap on calendars right here at the bottom quite hidden tap here and then you'll see all your calendars the calendars that you have created maybe you have one maybe you have quite a lot like i do uh, I have a few calendars here because I use them quite a lot and then at the bottom after your own calendars You'll see the subscribed calendars. Maybe it'll be just one maybe two maybe a ton But you'll definitely see here because it'll say subscribed as you can see right there Please keep in mind that on mine is like NFL schedule and Formula One because I have created those ones manually to show you in this video but on yours it may be a huge name like a crazy name it may be a link it may be a ton of crazy characters it doesn't matter because all you gotta do is delete those subscribed ones and to delete them to remove them completely it's super easy because all you gotta do is tap on the little eye as you guys can see and then unsubscribe and then unsubscribe once again and that's done i'm gonna do it for the formula one as well i unsubscribe unsubscribe and then you're done now i just have my calendars that i have manually created that i want them to be here so that's fine and that's pretty much it guys that's pretty much what i want to show you so if you're running ios 14 on your iphone still i do recommend that you click on this card that i'm gonna put right here or in the link in the description that i'll put below because as i said the process is a little bit different so i have a dedicated video on how to do exactly this in ios 14 if you're still on this version i actually have on ios 13 as well so if you're really behind you can see on iOS 13 because again it's different as well it changes in every single major iOS update all right so that's pretty much it if you enjoyed this video please make sure to hit the like button down below I really do appreciate it on top of that click on the subscribe button and the little bell icon to get notified whenever I post a new video and last but not least hit the comment box down below and tell me your feedback on this video if it helped you because I always do appreciate all your feedback right so that's pretty much it and i'll see you on my next video as usual bye bye